friends, uh, see where we are now on June 26. We are in Iceland at the Black Sand Beach. We are next to the Atlantic Ocean, as you see, and it's um, very beautiful here. Here you see a black beach. Most of the beaches, most of the coastline in Iceland is made of black sand, which is of volcanic origin, of course. And. Um, It's quite spectacular. I am very close to the city of Thorlaugshop, where you see you see it in the background here. We draw about a few kilometers outside of the city, and we are researching the dunes, sand dunes here, which are a very special shape. Here you find plenty of birds around and some of the birds come here to Iceland all the way from the South Africa and Antarctic. For example, Arctic Tern has the longest flight range, flight span among birds. It flights every year from, from Iceland to the Antarctic and back. It's quite aggressive bird. Arctic turn. If you come close to their uh, nesting places, they can really attack you. Also, here in Iceland, you find sea eagle. It's the biggest bird, which has the wingspan of two and a half meters. And there you see Nina. Sea eagles are also found here in Iceland. It's the biggest bird in Iceland. In fact, is Sea Eagle. I will get on the top here of the sand dune. Some grass here grows, as you see. And we have many flowers as well. Incredible view over the ocean and the neighboring coastline. So this is the south of Iceland. That's the view I have today. Look at the coastline. Volcanic sands of black color. Kind of they are, I would say, grayish color, but uh, when they are wet, they do look very black. Yeah, as you see. There you see the mountain called Ingolsfjall, the mountain of Ingolvur Arnarson. It's named after the first settler of Iceland, Ingolvur Arnarson, who came here from Norway, from the west of Norway. Uh, there is a monument to him in Reykjavik. Reykjavik is that direction. And his land stretched from Reykjavik, his land's possessions, all the way to that mountain, to the river. Uh, which is in Salfos over there, it's the city of Salfos. And this mountain was named after him, after Ingulvur Arason, as the legend says that he was buried on the top of it. The first settler of Iceland is buried on the top of this mountain called Ingolfjall. There is a place on the top of it uh, called Ingshot, or uh, the hill of Ingulvur. His name means Noble Wolf. And here you see the Atlantic Ocean. Very often I find here, uh, when I hike, uh, I find the bottles all the way from Colombia and Cuba. The ocean brings uh, very weird items sometimes in every possible language. See the sand dunes we have here. Incredible view, a bit windy today. We didn't go to the volcano, but we came here to the sand beaches 
sand beaches of Torlakzov. It's really beautiful. We like to come here. Something you can do as well if you come to Reykjavik is very close. It's just to drive south to Thorlaugshop and you can even book uh, uh, ATV tours, quadricycle tours here on the beach. Uh, if you type uh, Black Beach Tours, uh, Black Beach Tours, you can book uh, in Google. You can book tours with them. You will drive here the quadricycle. So, if you are interested, so that is uh, Scala Fatla Mountain. There you see, I climbed it, I made it to the top of that mountain some time ago, and uh, it's also named uh, after the Scali of uh, Ingolver Arnarson, uh, the first settler. So, many names here around are all connected with the first settler, like. Uh, in the Bible, uh, uh, in Israel, many places are associated with Moses, who was like the founder of a Hebrew nation. Here in Iceland, the local Moses is called Ingolvur Arnarsson, <laughs> and he was a Norwegian Viking. This is Iceland today on June 26. So now we have seen the black beaches of Thorlaugshop here in the south of Iceland between Thorlaugshop, that is Thorlaugshop, and Eirarbaki. There is another village called there Eirarbaki. And there is a restaurant here called Havi Plow. Or the blue ocean. You can also visit that restaurant here, right here. You can see it. It's a restaurant called the Blue Ocean or Harvey Blau. We went to dine there one day when Nina had birthday last year. We went there on her birthday day. It's a very beautiful place. Also here is amazing. Look. Look at the ocean and the colors of the waves. So, greetings from Iceland, all the best to you. Be well. So, here you see quadricycles. Uh, 80 tours uh, operated by Black Beach uh, Tours. You can book it online. It's pretty cool experience as you see. And uh, if you go to the web page of Hotel Ork in Kvaragerdi, Iceland, you can book a hotel stay along with the ITV tours on their website or you can go straight to the uh, website of this company call it Black Beach Tours and you can enjoy this ride with them if you like an idea for you if you come to Iceland <laughs> yes. That's so many. Here you see the birds. Uh, 
think those are just seagulls. And there is a highway that you see a car is driving. It's uh, between Eirarpaki and Thorlag Shop Highway or Salfos and Thorlag Shop. There is a big lake here. That's where the river of Olfusau enters uh, the Atlantic Ocean. 